find sin 1125 to find this we should follow this method c here we have 1125 now you should check 1125 lies between which two multiples of 180 what i mean is 1125 lies between 1080 and 1260 this is 180 into 6 and this is 180 into 7 in between these two numbers 1125 lies okay next now 1125 is close to which number this is close to 1080 so 1125 now should be written as 1080 plus 45 so this will become sin in place of 1125 now we should write this 1080 plus 45 this is your step 1 next sin in place of 1080 now we should write 6 into 180 plus 45 next here we have 180 so sin is not going to change it will remain sin and inside we get this angle 45 now the question is will we get here plus or minus to answer that we should look at the number before 180 that is 6 and 6 is even and all the even multiples of 180 they lie in either in the first or in the fourth qu fourth quadrant so now to select the quadrant we should look at this symbol here we have plus that means angle lies in the first quadrant and in the first quadrant sin is positive so we should put plus so plus sin 45 is 1 by root 2 this is our answer